Welcome to a new reading vlog. Um, today is June 1st. It is almost 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, so I wanted to update you with um, my reading progress. So I finished The Woods early this morning. But I'm going to count it as May because I read it all in one like setting, you know. Um, I had started at the end of last night and finished like two or three in the morning anyway I have not read anything today I've been doing some work and kind of just chilling out um but I'm going to pick up a book I'm not sure which one yet but I'm gonna pick up a book soon I've got about an hour till I have to leave to go pick up the kids so I think I'm going to start a book now but I hope you guys are all doing well see you later Hey guys, so I chose to continue reading Shadow Fever by Karen Marie Moni because I've been trying to read this forever and um, it is 2.40 and I've gotten about 20 more pages so that's pretty good. Um, I'm going to take this with me because I'll probably have some time before I pick up my kids to read a little bit and then the other book that I'm going to be reading is the graphic novel. So those are the two that I'm deciding to start with, which neither one of them were on my spin. But hey, what are you going to do? That's just what I feel like reading, so that's what I'm going to do. And this is a honking book. I'm just going to try to finish this in the next two days. So today, tomorrow, and so today is Friday. So by Sunday, I want to finish this by Sunday. I'm hoping we shall see. Anyway, just thought I'd update you, and I will talk to you later. Bye. Oh my gosh, you guys. I just sat here for like 10 minutes talking, and my camera wasn't recording. Anyway, I don't know if you can see. I'm doing a mask, face mask. It's gold, and it makes my skin feel so nice. But anyway, I'm coming to you to update you on my reading progress. I have read some of Shadow Fever. I got to page... 82 which I think I started on page like 44 or something so I haven't gotten a ton of reading done but it's been good reading like I've been really into it um sorry my kids are got recorders and they are blasting them but anyway so I am going to read for a little bit while my timer goes off for my face mask and then I will um be reading after that for a little while um and I've got a lot of video editing I need to do. I need to edit, finish editing the vlog for May 10th. No, yeah, May 10th to May 20th. And then I need to start also editing May 20th through May 31st. So that is that. And I have to, uh, I already filmed my June TBR, so I need to um, edit that. And I have to do, I have to make the video for my May wrap up and edit that and then my husband and I will be editing and filming and editing the eye for an eye videos because we have to do our wrap up video and June's eye for an eye challenge so lots to do lots to do um but I hope you guys are all doing well bye update time so it is like I don't know like 10 something on it is 1041 on June 1st and I have been reading this as much as I can today but it is such like a intense story that I think I need to put it down for now. I am on page 120 so that's good um and I love this story but this is such an intense one um there's just so much going on and it's intense so I think I need to put it down for something more lighthearted for a little while. So I think I'm going to pick up the city on the other side and hope that it is more lighthearted. Because <laughs> I don't know. I know it's about Faye, which so is Shadow Fever. But I think because it's a graphic novel and it's cutesy, I'm hoping it won't be as serious and like heavy. So I'm going to read this for a while. So, yeah, I'll let you know how far I get on that, too.
Hey guys, this is my last update for June 1st. It is 11.11 11 at night, and I just read 85 pages in The City on the Other Side. And it's really cute and good so far. Um, I'm hoping it's just a one, you know, issue. I haven't heard that there's more, but I don't know. I'm really tired, so... Like, I'm going to go to bed because I have to get up early for my son's last baseball game. They both have their last ever baseball game of the season. So, I'm going to go to bed because we have to get up early. And I will update you guys later. Bye! <laughs>like 1 45 in the afternoon both my kids had baseball today so we went and did that and now I'm cooking dinner and then we are going to or I'm going to read for a while while that is cooking so I just thought I'd update you I did get pretty far last night in shadow fever I read to page 121 I think and then I was like I gotta stop reading this for a while because it's deep. <laughs> so I have read to page 85 in the city of the uh, on the other side. It's super cute and good so far. So I'm going to continue to read for a while. Hope you're all having a good day. Bye. Good evening, guys. It is June 2nd. It is almost midnight. And I have gotten to page 264 in Shadow Fever. I'm enjoying it a lot, but because I've read it before, I keep thinking, when is this going to happen? When is this going to happen? And then I start to think, maybe I don't remember it as well as I think I do. Um, so we will see how that works. Anyway, I need to update you guys. It's been a long, long day. So I'm going to go to bed now, and I will update you guys tomorrow. Hello, everyone. So it is almost nine o'clock in the morning on May. Oh my gosh, I keep thinking it's May. It's June now. June 4th. I did not vlog at all yesterday. I had church um, and I'm like the sound plus camera person for my church. Um, so I was busy and then we had to go to my in-law's house because it was my brother-in-law's birthday and my soon-to-be brother-in-law is leaving to move him and my sister-in-law are moving away so we went to say goodbye to them too so um yeah it was a busy day yesterday so i did not vlog at all and i didn't feel very well um not in like a sick way but like i had a headache like all day so that was that um i didn't read much yesterday i don't think i read at all yesterday that is horrible but anyway, I'm going to do some reading now. Um, I am waiting for my friend to call because I went to work on videos last night and upload some of my vlogging uh, videos or clips and my computer said it was out of memory. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. So I was like, I called my friend and I was like, you need to help me figure out how to get space on my computer because I have two vlogs to edit and I've got five videos to edit oh my gosh so yeah that's been interesting um so I think I'm gonna read for a while and I will talk to you guys later quick update so I read for a little while and I finished the city on the other side and I gave it a four out of five stars it wasn't like the best graphic novel but it was super cute it was fast super short um i just wish there was more to the story i think that's why i couldn't give it a five you know i wish there was more that we could figure out what else happened but it was really really cute so 
finish that one for today. I have to go and do an errand. And then I'm going to come back and probably read some more in Shadow Fear. Because I'm going to try to finish this today. This honking, honking book. And then I can move on with my June TBR. So, that is my goal. See you later. <laughs> hey everyone! Today is June... What is today? <sighs> I literally forgot what today is. I know it's Tuesday? Tuesday. June 5th. There we go. Wow. Um, and I am working on cleaning up my computer so that I can update vlogs and stuff. So, yeah. But I have gotten some more reading done in Shadow Fever. I am now on page 378. So I'm making my way through that chunker. Um, but I'm going to do some of the computer cleanup so that I can get the last two vlogs up and a couple other videos that I've done. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing and I will update you guys later. Hey, hey Timothy. What? Mm. What you, you look really handsome in hats. Yeah. So do you have a girlfriend? No. Why not? Because I'm swagging savage cabbage, y'all. <laughs> Today is June 6th and it is 7.21 p.m. I have a very crazy update. I'm so excited and proud of myself. I have finished Shadow Fever. So, I finished that monster and um, now I've moved on. I am currently reading The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, but I'm super excited to try both of them out and I will let you know how it goes. Bye! Hi everyone! So today is June 7th. It is 9 o'clock in the morning and I am working on editing some videos because I've been way behind because my computer ran out of memory. So I went and had to get a uh, backup drive to put a lot of my stuff on. Um, so now I'm working on my second week vlog. <laughs> that uh was supposed to be up a while ago and I will also be working on the last week vlog so hopefully those will be up this week and then I've got my June TBR to post and my May wrap up to work on so I've got a lot of videos plus I have two of my dad's sermons that I need to edit and upload to his channel so it's gonna be a busy video day and I have to go to the laundromat. So this should be interesting. Um, but I wanted to update you guys. I have started uh, The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo um, by Taylor Jenkins Reid. I am not in love with this yet. Um, I'm only on page like 11 or 12. But I feel like everyone else like... I was in love with it from the beginning. Yeah, I'm on page 13. Anyway, I feel like everyone has been like raving about this and was in love with this in the beginning. And I don't feel it's as captivating for me as it is for other people. So hopefully it gets better. We'll see. I'm going to try. I'm going to at least read to page 100 because I've noticed lately that sometimes the beginning of the books for me are just not captivating but once I get you know 50 to 100 pages in then I'm oh my gosh I love it so I'm gonna keep going but that is what I'm going to do right now is work on some video editing
so I'm updating you. I did, uh, I edited my vlog from May 10th to the 20th, and I'm getting ready to upload that when I get back from picking up my kids. This is a telltale sign I'm gonna get ready to pick up my kids. Um, anyway, so I went to the laundromat with my mom, and I only read, like, three pages in The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. I'm trying to read this first, I think. I just want to read it and move on instead of trying to read two books at once. But this is actually being a struggle for me. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't know. I'll go into that later, I think. Um, maybe. <sighs> I have this problem where when everyone else seems to like something, I tend to not like it. And I don't know if it's because everyone likes it or if it's because I just don't like the same things as everyone else. For instance, I hate superhero movies and everyone else seems to love them, but I hate most of them. Most of them. I did not hate um, Ant-Man or like the very first Avengers, but I've pretty much hated or not really liked the rest of them. Oh, except for Guardians. I love the Guardians. But I've been noticing lately that the same thing is happening with books. Whenever there's a huge hype around a book, I'm like, mm, not really sure it's for me, but I want to read it because everyone else loves it. And this, so far, like I said, I'm only, let's see, 20 pages into it. So, I'm hoping that it will get better and that I will love it like everyone else does. So, I'm going to read this for a while while I'm waiting for my son to get out of school. And, yeah, I think that's the plan. What's today's date? June 8th. It is 4.50 p.m. I worked today, so I didn't get to update you guys this morning. But I got to page 50 in The Seven Hub Husbands of Evelyn Hugo by Taylor Jenkins Reid last night. And I'm starting to enjoy it more, so that's good. Um, still, I'm not quite sure if it's my thing, but I'm going to still give it chances because now I'm enjoying it a little bit more. Um... But I just wanted to update you on that and now I am going to be working on some videos and reading and doing some laundry. So that's what I'll be doing. So I will update you guys later. Bye! Hey guys, so it is 11.10 or ish on June 9th. Hang on. I think it's the 9th. Might be the 8th. 
I never know. June 8th. Um, anyway, and we went out as a family and kind of hung out for a little while. Um, and I got a couple things, so I wanted to share those with you. Um, the first thing that I got was a book, and it was You Are a Badass at Making Money, Master the Mindset of Wealth by Jenny Sincerio. Um, I read You Are a Badass, the original one she wrote, and I loved it. I saw this in my business. I own a business, um, and I've been having some issues, so I thought, you know, maybe it's my mindset, so hopefully this will help me. And then I also got something to hopefully help me with YouTube and be more consistent, but also to help me with my business as well, and that is a planner, and this starts July of this year and goes till December of 2019. So it's huge and it's pretty, um, and I will maybe be doing a plan with me video, I don't know yet, uh, for July. There was a spider on my arm. I hate spiders. And now I don't know where I blew him. Okay, yeah. anyway. Sorry for the snoring. My husband's sleeping. I also got these stickers and stuff to go with it. So I will show you more of that like later. But it's really late. But of course... I can't sleep. I don't know why, but I'm having trouble sleeping. So, I was thinking about possibly reading more of The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, but I just don't want to. Like, I thought about watching TV. I don't want to. I thought about reading the book. I don't want to. <sighs> I don't know. But I'm, like, not tired enough to sleep. So... I don't know what I'm doing. Um, uh, my youngest son has a baseball game tomorrow at like 9, so I should be sleeping, but I'm a night owl. I am just am, so I don't know. I need to go to sleep, but I'm having real struggles. I just don't know, guys. Like... Have you ever had this issue where, like, you know you need to sleep? You're kind of tired, but you're just not that tired where you know you're going to be able to fall asleep fast. I mean, I even sat here and watched book con after book con after book con vlogs to try to get me to go to sleep because they're, like, 30 minutes long. Nothing. Like, I was too interested. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway... Hopefully you guys are all having a better time than me, and will be asleep already. So yeah. Anyway, I will catch up with you guys tomorrow.
so you've been watching me bake a little bit just so you know I am a horrible baker I don't bake I am a cook give me a piece of meat I can cook it you're gonna love it baking not my thing I'm gonna keep trying but it's just not I don't know I don't know what it is anyway the cookies aren't turning out the way I wanted them to because or the way that the recipe said the recipe was like don't squish the real blueberries there's no way not to when you're trying to form a freaking bowl anyway I don't know what's gonna happen I'm gonna take these and I'm going to put them in the oven and hopefully they turn out okay also, I read about 30 more pages in The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. I'm intrigued, I'm intrigued. Still not like my oh my gosh, but who knows, maybe it'll get there. Anyway, just thought I'd update you. Bye. Today is the end of yet another 10 day reading vlog. Um, thank you so much for watching and if you like these vlogs hit the subscribe button and the little bell to get more notifications when I post the vlogs. And remember that a reader lives a thousand lives and so can you. So keep on reading. I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye!